Let us turn to God in prayer. God of light and God of glory, may the same spirit that was with the writers of your word be with us now, the hearers of your word. Amen. Our first scripture lesson is from Hebrews chapter 11, verses 1 through 3 and 9 through 14, which can be found on 1096 of your Pew Bible. The book of Hebrews was written for a specific community. The theme of the book centers on the importance of faith. Listen to how the word refer- the author references the Old Testament while illustrating the faith of Abraham. Now faith is the assurance of things hoped for, the conviction of things not seen. Indeed, by faith our ancestors received approval. By faith we understand that the words were prepared by the word of God, so that what is seen was made from the things that are not visible. By faith, he stayed for a time in the land that had been promised, as in a foreign land, living in tents, as did Isaac and Jacob, who were heirs with him of the same promise. For he looked forward to the city that, was, that has foundations, whose architect and builder is God. By faith, he received power of proclamation, even though he was too old. And Sarah herself was barren, because he considered himself him faithful who had, who had promised. Therefore, from one person, and this one as good as dead, descendants were born, as many as the stars of heaven and as the innumerable grains of sand by the seashore. All of these died in faith without having received the promises, but from a distance they saw and greeted him. They confessed that they were strangers and foreigners on the earth, for people who speak in this way make it clear that they are seeking a homeland. God always blesses the reading and hearing of Scripture. 